Hey guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. Today we're in iTunes 11 and I'm going to be showing you how to create your very own ringtones from the music that you already own. So in order to do that, go ahead and open up iTunes and select the song that you want to use as your ringtone. Go ahead and select that song and then right click on that song. Once you have done that, go ahead and go to Get Info, just like that. Once you're under this panel here, you want to select the Options tab in the upper right-hand corner. Once you're there, you'll see the Start and Stop Time options here, and you want to keep the ringtone under 30 seconds. Anything over 30 to 32 seconds does not get recognized as a ringtone. So go ahead and make sure you keep that between 22 to 30 seconds. So go ahead and choose a start time and then go ahead and choose a stop time that is again about 30 seconds out from your original start time. Once you have done that, go ahead and click OK. Now, once again, you are going to right click on that same song. Scroll down until you see the Create AAC version in the option, just like that. It will create another version of that song, and it'll be the 30-second clip that you have created in the previous step. Now, once you have done that, you want to right-click on the new 30-second clip, and then go to Show in Finder. If you're using a Windows, it will say Show in Windows Media or Show in Windows Folder. Either way, you want to find that file within your computer. So I'm going to go ahead and click on show in finder. Once I have done that, I then want to drag that specific file. It should say .m4a onto my desktop just like so. Once I have done that and I have dragged the file onto my desktop, I then want to right click on that file on my desktop and go to get info just like that. This panel, this panel will then pop up. You want to change the extension for this file from a M4A to an M4R, which will create the ringtone file. Go ahead once you've done that and X out of that. It'll say, are you sure you want to change the extension? And then you will say, yes, I want to use the new extension. Once you've done that, this is a very important step. You want to go in and remove the 30 second clip that is already in iTunes. So right click on that, go down until you see delete and delete that file. Go ahead and delete it now. Once you've done that, go over to your desktop where the new ringtone file is going to be sitting and double click that file. It will begin playing within iTunes. Go ahead and pause that. And now if you go over to your sidebar under tones, you will see now that new ringtone has been created. And then all you've got to do after that is click and hold that ringtone and drag it into your iPhone once you've connected your iPhone to your computer. Again, guys, this is a very simple and easy way on how to create ringtones very quickly within iTunes 11. If you have any questions or tips that you'd like to share, go ahead and put those in the comment box below. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching my videos. It does help me out. Like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys next time.